hi welcome and thanks for watching and subscribing this is line number in the isometric drawing okay so this uh, 150 is the nominal line size and this NT is the process media so this NT is means uh, nitrogen we have a different uh, process media we have AI AU utility uh, AU utility air AI instrument air or CO carbon dioxide GL glycol OL lube oil what is PG process gas or what is BL frail so that's one is the different uh, process media so let's go back here what is this 20 this is a 20 is the system identifier okay and this n is a sequence number we have a xxx here xx y y y and this is the pipe class and you can see this x this is speech extension and what is this ia this ia is the insulation type and this x is the insulation thickness insulation thickness okay ia the insulation type so in the isometric, if you can, if you see this isometric, this is a line isometric, like like for example this one. Then go down. Is our north. Okay. You are if you are familiar, this like this are the arrow. If you are familiar here. So what is this in the line in the isometric? This is this stay very important. Very important this arrow. So this arrow is the flow direction. Okay? Flow direction. Remember this is a flow direction. This is a very important because if you uh, for example if actual this uh, uh check bulb this is very important because the check bulb uh, you can see the flow direction the check bulb this the uh, like for example this is the si this is the symbol of a uh, check bulb and this is the arrow if your flow direction is like this okay also the flow direction of the check bulb is going there okay so this are very important of the flow direction and the flow direction of also the check bulb okay so uh, thanks for watching uh, and see you next time I hope you uh, understand and um, learn out, learn and learn about this uh, line number okay bye Hi, welcome and thanks for watching and subscribing. Now we will compute this uh, angle to find length of sides when the angle is known. Okay. So we have a given here. We have a given here. This travel is a 28 and our angle is a 45 degrees. So we will find this set and run using formula. Okay. So let's start and please take note for our formula. So first we will find this set. We have a set one and problem okay. set one and problem so our question here set and one is our given and this 45 so let's compute First the set. So first, uh, 
we will find this 45 degrees sine okay, sine to find this set sine of 45 degrees so sine press this sign and then 45 equals and then multiply it to 28 is our given the travel multiply it to 28 okay Answer 19.79. So please run up 20. So our answer here is 20 hours set. Okay. So next, let's find this one. This 45 degrees we will get into cosine. We get this one. Okay. In the set is sign to find this set. In this one we will use it cosine to find this one. Then cosine 45 degrees. Press this cosine and next 45. And then equals this one answer the answer of 45 degrees cosine 0.707 and then multiply it to This is a 45 degrees, so the, our answer is 20. So of course, this is our also uh, 20 here, our line. Okay, because our uh, angle is a 45. This is square. Square. We have a here. for watching and bye see you next time hi uh, welcome okay brother thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing me so today uh, I'm gonna show you how to get how to find take off of 90 degrees and 45 degrees elbow okay using formula I gonna show I uh, gonna show you all the formulas for the vibing just uh, first uh, this uh, formula for the piping of the elbow take up the elbow take up of the 45 degrees elbow okay so for example this is our uh, 90 degrees elbow our size is a uh, six inch. Also, this forty-five elbow is six inch. Okay. So, so our formula for the ninety degrees is nominal pipe size. Multiply it to one point five or 38.1 so for example 6 inch multiply it to 1.5 equals take off 
or 6 inch multiply it to 38.1 whilst take off okay for the 45 uh, degrees elbow so nominal pipe size or NPS multiply it to 0.625 or uh, 6 inch multiply it to 15.8 15.8 equals take off or 6 inch multiply it to 5.8 equals take off okay that is very easy so uh, this is all the formula for the take off for the 90 degrees and the 45 degrees elbow okay so thanks for watching bye hi hi to find the uh, this center to center of elbow this picture mark and this is good okay our given is, is this elevation 2500 and this elevation 2000 and then our uh, diameter of pipe is 8 inch so let's start for computation first uh, elevation 2500 2500 minus it elevation 2000 Twice. So the answer is 500 and then multiply it to 1.414 The 7 or 7 this 1.414 this is constant for the 45 so our answer for this center to center of elbow is 7 or 7. 7 or 7. So next, this is full. To find this is full, we must know the takeoff. So our uh, formula for the 45 degrees take off is 15.8 uh, 15.8 15.8 multiply with 2 size of pipe diameter 8 inch so, 126.4 So our airborne is 2 1 and 2 multiply to 2 times 2 so our answer for the take off take off is 2.5 this is our take off 2.8 then minus it to center to center of elbow 7 or 7 7 0 7 minus it to 2 5 2.8 so our spool Four five four point two. This is our answer for this school. Four five five four point two four five four point two. Okay. So we have answer for this. The center to center of elbow, correct? And this is full. Four power four five four point two. Okay, correct. Back up. Okay. So it's done.
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.